Oh my god. Oh boys. 7.5 million dollars. Easy peasy. Hey there guys, MCB here, and today we're going to be playing some Minecraft Pocket Edition Factions. We're here on the SD Craft Network, and this video is a little bit different. Uh, we do have a raid for you, but for the most part, this is just going to be us building our new base, because we have been stuck at the F home for quite a while now, and after all the raids in the last video, plus some raids that are going to be coming in the video after this, we basically just completely filled up the base. Alright, we, we just filled up that base, we filled up all our PVs, and I had nowhere to store all of this good gear, so I made myself a new base. But before we get into it, if you enjoy the video, please feel free to subscribe. It is very much appreciated. And of course, leave a like. Uh, let's see if we can get to, I don't know, 20 likes on this video. That would be amazing. And I will see you all in the video. All right, boys. So this is the base that we are currently in. This is the leader base for slash F info blue rose. Uh, we were F top four like a few days ago. Uh, we got raided, but uh, let's just say I'm not too worried about it. We, we've, we've got some plans. Not to flex, but uh, you know. Um, but yeah, we have our leader base here. And of course, we have a separate base for the recruits and members. And uh, right now, the space is pretty full of just like everything. After the last video, I kind of just stuffed like all of it into these chests. And I filled up 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, uh, about 12 and a half dubs of gear. However, I cannot store 12 and a half dubs of gear. So, of course, we're gonna have to make our own base here, and I haven't had my own base on the server since, I believe, before the reset. After the reset, I just kinda chilled with Blue Rose and let them do their thing. This is, this is the new base so far. It is literally just a one by one. This is, this is literally all we've got. However, I set up a base on Minecraft PC edition, made sure everything looked good. I got the schematic in text form here, um, and we're going to be building this. So let's get straight into the time lapse.
All right, so that is basically it for the building. It's a very, very simple base. We've got spawner rooms one and two right here, and we're just gonna put whatever spawner thing we need to grind. Anything should fit in there, uh, except like iron golems, but iron golems aren't gonna be the type of thing I grind in this base. Uh, here we've got our AFK pool. I don't actually know whether this is allowed. If it's not, I might have to remove it. Uh, this is gonna be where we spawn in at. Uh, this is gonna have enchanting tables and anvils in it once I figure out how to actually get them. Uh, we've got a nice simple parkour here. You know, you go up here, jump over to here, here and to here it's it's very very simple i might extend it i don't know but that is basically it for the base building i will probably hopefully maybe figure out some way that we can get the nether stars the armor and the item frames uh the anvils and the enchanting tables and i'm gonna see whether it's actually allowed to use these afk pools i have no idea so i'm gonna have to confirm all that but other uh it's a very very simple bedrock design i might try making a bigger base in the future but right now like this is pretty good in terms of storage and i don't really have anyone other than me living here so it doesn't have to be too spacious that is not all for the video though i also got one raid and uh we will head into that now so enjoy all right guys so we have found ourselves the raid for this video i'm only going to be doing one since the main thing is going to be building i have overclaimed this uh there is a shadow here which leads up to like a sky base but there's nothing inside of the sky base and as you can see it's basically just an empty flat thing of bedrock i don't know if there ever was something there but right now you know pretty barren however i saw that the bottom of this was also pretty screwed up and uh, i went down here and again this was still claimed at the time and I saw that there was a large bedrock box. And this part right here was actually obsidian. There was no bedrock here. So I just broke in. And uh, as you can see right here, we've got ourselves some chests. So, all right, we got uh, Emperor Sword, Monthly, Assassin Gear, Mythic, Mythic, Monthly. I guess we can take the Monthly. Um, yeah, all right, so we'll take all that. Another Monthly pick, some more obsidian. Uh, what's in here? We got uh, Mythic Warlord. All right, that's promising. More Mythic, more Mythic. Demon King Legendary. Warlord Axe again. Uh, monthly Leggings. And we got three dark gray colors here. All right, let's see if these are actually worth anything. Uh, that one has expired, and this one has expired so they are worthless but it's a nice two chests of gear uh hopefully we can actually get some pvp soon to use up all this armor because i have not gotten a lot of pvp recently but uh yeah i think i'm putting this after i built my base so from here we're going to be going straight into the opening and then into the outro so i will see you in there all right my boy gifted us a vote crate so you know we gotta open it i don't even know how i open it oh i can just left i can just right click it okay so let's see what we can get here we got spawner okay 7k check Oh my god. Oh, boys. $7.5 million. Easy peasy. Another 250k. We got colors. Colors. A uh, ton of emerald blocks here, which we just let sell all on. And what is this? A Demon King kit. Very, very nice. All right, guys. So that is nearly it for the video. But we do have some stuff to open. We got ourselves four special relics. So we're going to go ahead and open these up here, I guess. You know, it's a nice, nice little simple area. So we'll open up the first one, see what we get. We got uh, two rusty tags. Very nice. 500k check. Do not mind if I do. As well as a stack of gold blocks. So we can use that sell all. Uh, what is this? We got a 500k check and an iron golem spawner. There we go, boys. And for those of you that are not aware, an iron golem spawner is actually worth, if I remember correctly, 1.75 million. Yes, it is. So that is 2.25 million. And this one gives us a toxic tech and a dark gray color. So we'll go ahead and put all of that away in our PVs. And I would say that's a pretty nice opening right there. But that is going to be it for the video. So I hope you all enjoyed. And I will see you on my next episode of SDCraft, Minecraft Population Factions. Peace.